Michigan Solicitor General makes history by breaking a big barrier at the U.S. Supreme Court. Today, Fadwa Hamoud became the first Arab American Muslim woman to argue before the U.S. Supreme Court. The case originated in Kalamazoo in 2007 and has now made it all the way to the high court. Sean Lay spoke to Hamoud shortly after the hearing. And Sean, was this the career highlight that she envisioned? Well, she was. this was a business trip for her. She was arguing that case she referred to on behalf of the state of Michigan. But afterwards, with a little reflection in our discussion, she said this was indeed about representation. A girl from Fortson High School and then a student from Wayne State Law being able to do things to, to get to the highest court in the land and argue a case like this. Others, she said, can learn from this day from her. Every single one of the justices actually asked the question. Uh, Justice Kavanaugh was on the phone, but every single one of the justices uh, obviously was interested. Moments after making history as the first Arab American Muslim woman to argue a case before the Supreme Court, we spoke with Michigan Solicitor General Fadwa Hamoud as she and Attorney General Dana Nessel were leaving the highest court in the land. It really is surreal. The Attorney General and I both went to Wayne State Law School. Uh, we went to an urban law school and we bring all of that here to the Supreme Court and to the Capitol and to Washington, D.C. with us. And this is what's so wonderful about our experience. I know that my family is here, came surprised me. Uh, my husband, my children, my, my father, my colleagues are here. Hamoud is a first generation American, a Fortson High School graduate, and now an inspiration to others. My name might be different, my background's different. Uh, our faces are different, but when we go in there, we bring our collective communities there with us. Fadwa came to this country at 11 years old, not speaking a word of English. And here, you know, just a, a mere, you know, 25 years later, she is arguing in the most articulate way possible before the United States Supreme Court. And to me, you know, this is the story of America. All right, back here live. Fadwa Hamoud, uh, she was surprised uh, walking into the Supreme Court today on the steps. Her family, her husband, Ali Hamoud, is an attorney, and her children were there to wish her luck. Only about 30 minutes it took to argue this uh, case before, this, uh, before the U.S. Supreme Court on behalf of Michigan. And then afterwards, she met with uh, the Senate and congressional representatives from Michigan. And at 3 o'clock, she had a meeting at the White House. So very interesting day for the highest uh, appellate uh, lawyer in the state. Back to you. Boy, yeah, really good stuff. Kind of like the AG said there, the American dream really exhibiting itself there. there All right, Sean, thanks.